In this lesson, let's discuss about the another data type in X++ programming language, which is called as a strings. And strings are a sequence of characters that are used as a text, helpline, address, telephone numbers, and so on. To declare a string in X++, we use a str keyword. And we have already seen in our previous classes that when declaring a variable of string, we use a str keyword. A string can hold an indefinite number of a character. And if you know the absolute maximum of the character that a string is going to hold, then you can specify this in a variable declaration and force a turnication of a maximum length of a string. And string literal, and string literals are a character that are enclosed in a quotation mark. And we have already known this one. We have already seen that when we initialize the value of string, we use a string literal at that time when, when we see a string. And can be used where string expression are expected. And here are some examples of, see, we use a nothing inside a quotation mark. And if you want the string to span more than one line, then you need to precede it with an error character. For example, you can see over here, which is a str, and s is equals to, and you can see at the font we have a error sign, that sign, and we have a string literal over here, which expands to a multiple line. So this is all about the string and in the next lesson, we'll go and see about the strings in a practical way and how we can use it in our code. So I hope you guys had some basic understanding on the strings data type in X++ and I will see you in the next video. Until then, have a great day.